my beautiful makeup geeks. I hope you guys are doing great today. Um, I wanted to review some lip stains for you guys because I know it's getting close to summer. I don't know about you, but I don't want to have to reapply lipstick or lipstick all day long, especially when it's hot out. I feel like everything's melting. I want something that just lasts all day without having to reapply. So I love using lip stains right now. So I got some different brands for you that I wanted to review. One high end and two low end or drugstore, whatever you want to call it. So let's start with the high end one. This one is by Josie Moran, and you can see my swatch here already. I did it on the bottom part of my hand because I didn't want to have all these red stains on the top part of my hand because they really do stain and last all day long. So anyways, Josie Moran was the first one that I bought. I didn't really see many lip stains about a year ago, but lately they've become really popular because they just, you apply them almost like a marker. So they're foolproof, you know, any, a kid can draw with a marker and that's all you need to do is just draw it on the lips and it stains at that color. But my favorite color by Josie Moran is Foxtrot, and it's this one right here, and I already swatched it for you guys, this one here. It's a really pretty deep berry color. Um, if you want to have lips like Anne Hathaway, you know how she has that kind of just bitten type of look, they're just kind of a stained, this would be what you want to use a lip stain. But I love the quality of this. They're very pigmented, they're easy to apply. Um, they're really rich colors and they last a long time. I've had this for several months and it hasn't dried out at all yet. The only downside is the price. I believe it's around $19 or $20, so it is going to be costly compared to the other two that I have to show you next, but they are good quality. Um, the other ones I have is a Co CoverGirl and a Revlon one, and I also noticed Maybelline came out with one too, but I haven't tried those yet. But um, let's start with the CoverGirl. Uh, the size of this is the exact same size as the Josie Moran one, and my favorite color from the Color Girl is number 420, and it's a really pretty kind of um, pinky color. So let me show you guys. Hold on. It's this color right here. You see how it's kind of a light rosy pink? It's a more natural color, and this would look great on um, fair to medium skin. This color here would be great on medium to dark skin, but... Isn't that a gorgeous color? These also, it hasn't dried out on me yet. I've had this for about um, a month or so, and it's done really well. And I think the price of these, again, are like um, $6 or so, and you can get them at any drugstore, so they work really great. The last one I have is the one by Revlon, <clears throat> and these are the Revlon Just Bitten. These, honestly, are my favorite. I love them because, for one, they're a little bit larger. You can see you get a little bit more product in them. And they have a lot of colors. My favorite one from this one is this coral color, which is Flame. So let me show you that. And as you guys can see, it's, you know, it's just like a marker. But isn't that a gorgeous pink color? I don't know if you guys can see the um, detail of that. But see how it's like a nice, bright, kind of warm, corally pink. It's really pretty. I, I've worn this several days in a row. And these also don't dry out. I've had these for a month also, and they work amazingly well. And then also what I like about this on the other end is a moisturizer. It's like a lip balm. So you just take this off, and then you just apply the lip balm and rub it on top of the stain, and it keeps your lips nice and moist. The only thing with that, hold on, I got lipstick on it. Well, that looks lovely. <laughs> the only thing with it is it's, it's almost like a little glue stick, but the little part right here can fall out. So just be careful with that because then you'll lose your moisturizer. But I thought that was really inventive. You have the stain on one side, moisturizer on the other. So out of the three, I have to say Revlon 1. Woo! <laughs> so anyways, go to makeupgeek.com, the link below. I have all of these swatched for you guys because I bought a ton of different colors. You could see, okay, which one do I like? Which one do I want to buy? So hopefully it helps you guys out. But anyways, have fun with your lip stains this summer. I'd like to see what colors you guys come up with. So um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Have a great week, you guys. Stay warm out there. And as always, be happy and healthy. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye.